Jeez. Oh, what was it like? Well, it didn't have sunlight. It was very, um, it was familiar. It was, I, I still, to this moment, in feeling it back, I can't find yellow. There was sound everywhere, but the sound was so pleasant. It was like the sound carried the air. Oh, wow. And the, the vibe. You know, it was just so, so you know, like, what's it going to be like thing? on the organic no timeline? Everyone's, you know, peace, love, mung beans sort of thing. And I'm like, no, it just think of a place that doesn't have divide and conquer conflict, control domination, that you have no fear in, that you learn through inspiration, not conflict. That's a different fucking place altogether. And that's when she started saying, I can't get to the organic. <laughs> right. <laughs> you know what? You you actually saying that, those words, I'm beginning to understand why you can't just go flip, I'm on the organic. To even exist in a place that is just inspiration, you still have to be fucking really embodied. There's mm. none of this halfway. So you have to get rid really, of all these really matrix concepts, that. the matrix fear, the matrix limitations, the oh my God. holding oh. space is an interesting concept, right? For example, when I do a healing or whatever, or if I'm going to, you know, rip out whatever or whatever it is, it's like at that moment I'm holding a space for those people to meet this energy. So they're doing their own healing, so to speak, right? I'm creating a platform for it to happen. I'm facilitating it. Oh, yeah, so, that's it. Yes. So yeah. what I'm saying is, number one, I don't believe anyone can take you somewhere they haven't been. So if someone's yes. saying, I'll show you what it's like out of the matrix, if they haven't been outside of the matrix, I don't believe they can take you there. They can't hold the frequency. If... Most healing is about returning to integrity, returning to the original codes, returning to health, returning to everything before the fuckery. Then someone needs to have done that, to be in that sort of integrity to take you there, in my opinion. So this, I mean, when I do the classes, when I teach people this shit, what I literally do is hold space until they can greet it and then their training wheels come off. Right? You're in the training wheels come off situation. That's why it's wobbly. But this is you walking your talk, right? Yeah. Or sorry, strutting your stuff. <laughs> well, uh, uh, strutting the stuff is like the upgrade to walking the but talk. What, so what I'm saying now is pull your energy from any situation where you're supporting anti-life, an agenda that's not aligned with essence, etc., 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 and you watch things change. People have to do it for themselves. Mm -hmm. End of story. So my point in all of this is I ain't holding space for no one. The only thing I'm holding space for is Moo and the organic no timeline. That's it. Mm -hmm. So I suppose I can't remember why we, why that came up. Why we were talking? You were talking about healing. Oh, you were talking about like the idea of like oh being able to yeah like to 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 maintain that existence. And this is why I'm saying you can't organic. just commit to self momentarily. It has to be moment by moment. Every moment. I, you know, redefine. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what I'm feeling Ooh. with all this... With all... <laughs> Before you start feeling, I need to start inhaling, so keep it coming up. <laughs> 
no, I what I'm what I'm saying is that um, it really watching things being exposed, watching things sort of write itself, and where you're at, and where where I see everything is kind of heading, the, the polarity of it's like the enmeshing of the organics with the with the matrix. It's really starting to demand the pull apart you know yeah. it's really demanding it totally and i mean i get why this chick's coming on with the three earths yeah because it's like you know it's a straddle right now you're choosing every moment am i going to be in that fuckery or am i going to be in this fuckery yeah it's fucking like and it's happening whether you want it to or not it's like that's the it's it's not even urgency it's like the demand it's urgency. <laughs> Don't kid yeah. yourself. Because okay, it's urgency. The trains left the tracks, honey. It's 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 chuff chuffing along. This is like you're either on this train or you isn't. And if you isn't, that's fucking fine. <clears throat> See you in the next creation phase. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, hello, you again. Holy moly. What else can I tell you it's about? It's really this? ending. It's really, really, really ending. For me, on the organic no timeline, I can feel like the pulsations through me are the deepest indigo purple and gold. It's like just sitting and communing with the surround Everything has presence. Everything has juju. Everything has a story. Everything has a give and take, right? It's like a symbiosis. And so in that place, when I connect with the mooster, it's, it's just, of course, of course, you know, and fortifying and whatevs. And, but, I mean... My desire to go there has been the driving force. Not my desire to leave here. But the desire to, to go there. Exactly. So you can feel the difference in the energising. Yes, 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 yes. Subtle, but, you know, the semantics make a difference in this. in this. Because if you're energising, I want to leave, I want to leave, you're energising how shit it is and your desperation to leave. But well, if you're energised, well, for me, going up. if you're leaving, all you're doing is preparing. When that do you is actually so true. Like, make the leap? I'm leaving. Yeah, I'm yeah, getting ready to I leave. Get... I'm leaving. I'm leaving now. Leaving. Still haven't gone. Yeah. Again, for it's like I remember I was. Are they? 